Hey guys and girls, welcome to uh, this set of tutorials which will show you how to make a very basic uh, tank game, uh, sort of capture the flag style. So the first thing we are going to do is create a new room. And to do that, we're just going to use this button here, create a room, and we're going to go to the settings button. So the first thing we're going to do is configure the rooms. So the rooms sort of like the level that you're going to be playing in. I'm going to call this level one, and we're going to make it 800 by 608, speed 30, uh, and we can move all of this name, just click the tick button. So you can see on the left hand side under rooms, we've got one room currently. We are going to create a background. Uh, on the rim, so what we can do is what it should say is we're going to create a um, a background that we can use in the room. So we're going to go and create a background. We're going to name the uh, background and we're going to call it uh, BCK underscore level one background for level one. I'm going to click edit background. We're going to transform the canvas and we're going to resize it and we're going to make that 800 by 608. I'm going to keep the aspect ratio, everything else is fine and we're going to just click OK. That gives us um, the same size as our rim size. And we can just design our room in here. And what I'm going to do is I'm simply going to pick uh, a color. And I'm going to fill the background in with that color. Pick, OK, and that's that. We now need to open the room that we created. So under rooms, we have to just double click on here and that will reopen the room. And what we want to do is we want to apply our background that we've just made to this room. So we're going to click the background button. Okay. And we're going to click where it says no background. And we're going to say use BCK underscore level one. And as you can see, it has applied our background to the room. Okay, so that's our background done and applied to our first room, our first level. So what we're going to do is just click the tick and then we need to save this. I'll save and I'm going to hit the green run button just to test that it's working. See what happens. And as you can see, Perfect, so we've got our first room with the background, games are running, uh, happy with that, and I'll see you in part two.